What is going on? My name is Ario DeJuice from ariodejuice.com. Bad lighting. It's getting dark as you can see, so I have to make this fast. Anyway, be sure to join the email list, um, which can be discovered on the website. A little loud out here. Oh, she came all the way with me. Hey, what's going on? All right, so um, yeah, email list on the website. It's my first and last name.com. I'll leave the link or the URL in the box below of this video. And yeah, join to not um, basically lose contact with this channel and podcast. This is a podcast available for your, your um, enjoyment. Um, more information down below about that. Yeah, man, do that and you're all set. Um, yeah, so let's talk. So, fresh from the gym, got on this um, cool pair of tights. Yes, sir. So, I wish these came with drawstrings, but they do come with compartments. There's two pockets, one on each side, obviously. Um, yeah, man, so I wish they came with drawstrings, but that's not the point of this video. The point of this video is me updating you. Try, come on. Let me get back inside. Get a little loud out there. Let me give you some better lighting also. Yeah, man, I'm just giving you some updates on the live stream that will be released this week. I don't have a date yet, but it will be released. So what you have to do is be sure to um, subscribe to the channel. I'm going to release a, a post on this channel to kind of give people more information. And um, basically, that's where you'll learn what time and date that live stream will be released. You can mark your calendar and you're all set. So um, what I wanted to discuss is... This debate I plan on having this week, and I spoke about it on the previous video two days ago. Basically, I want to have a debate on jock straps, right? Male athletes wearing jock straps, and I'm understanding that there is also a fitness thong for men or male athletes. Yes, some male athletes wear fitness thongs when they're performing their workouts or their sport. Um, and that's interesting because I don't, um, I didn't know that obviously. And um, I'm still new to wearing jock straps, new, <laughs> meaning like I just started wearing this stuff and I'm a fan of it already. But um, yeah, it's interesting because some people, mostly males or and women wear thongs, but I did not know they designed thongs for male athletes. Now, I do understand this from certain people that the male thongs that I'm referring to, they're not really used for, I guess, sports such as baseball, football, basketball, stuff like that. The fitness thongs for men are used, you know, I won't say mainly, but they're popular in the, the dancing world. So if you do ballet, I'm understanding that some, certain, it's not certain, some male dancers wear fitness thongs when they're performing ballet, right? New information for me. Again, I don't wear thongs. Um, I don't really have a reason to wear thongs at all. I prefer jock straps. Um, and, the, and the main reason why I prefer jock straps is the jock straps that I, you know, purchased, you could barely see the linings on them, right? And for some people, that's a big deal. I guess for me, I won't say it's a big deal, but it's kind of nice to not have that so visible, right? I don't think people need to see that. That's really none of their business. So uh, being able to, you know, wear jock straps that does prevent that from happening is a win-win for me because that's what I'm looking for. Now, you may be the opposite. Maybe you want complete and, you know, total, you know, um, like no visible linings whatsoever. It got dark veins over here. Um, maybe you're that person. And it's all good. Let me go back outside. Maybe it's a little quiet. We'll see. But maybe you're that person and you, um, again, you don't want any type of lining showing on your, when you're doing whatever. So it makes sense for you to go and purchase or get yourself a, maybe a, a male fong or whatever to prevent that from happening. That makes sense to me. Again, not for me because I don't really have a reason to do that. The jock straps are just fine. And they're, they are so perfect for my workouts. I'm talking from squats, any high intensity workout. They seem to do the job very well. And I'm a fan of that, right? So again, it's going to be a very fun debate. I think it's going to be fun. 
we kind of already had a semi debate about the about the two accessories last week and because that live stream went so well it was so successful i thought it'd be kind of cool to have a dedicated live stream about that and just kind of go from there now i will be having two guests on the live stream and they they will go back and forth and um it's gonna be it should be a friendly debate it should be something um educational at least for me it will be and it should be a lot of fun right so again i don't have the actual date or time yet but this is why you should subscribe to the channel make sure you hit the bell notification and all that stuff to stay up to date when that live stream will be released you will get a chance to consume the information shy come on come on go. there she is hey go 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 now make, come on. Okay, she don't stand. Come on, come on, come on. All right, there we go. <laughs> anyway, so uh, yeah, I encourage you to join the uh, email newsletter and subscribe to the channel. Um, that is um, when you're going to release. I'm, I'm going to release the information on the, the live stream. The time and day should be all set. Once again, should be a really fun debate. Um, it was a real good one last week. It wasn't really meant for that. It just led to those conversations. And it's interesting because I, I actually did research on the two. And um, yeah, it's really interesting what's going on. And, um, you know, there's there's actual athletes on this channel who very much could, I guess, confirm that they've never seen actual male athletes wear fitness thongs when they're performing their workouts or their sports. And that's something interesting to know because... Um, there's people saying the opposite. So it really is going to be a very interesting debate if you're into this type of information. Obviously, if not, it's cool. But as an athlete myself, as a runner, an avid runner, a gym freak, this is interesting information because I wear jock straps. I'm wearing one. I'm right, rare. I'm wearing one right, right now. I can't talk tonight. I'm wearing one right now. That's what I meant to say. A little tongue twist. But yeah, man. So me being a uh, a fan of jock straps, this information does very much interest me a lot. It just does because I, I think jock straps and leggings are just the best combination if you're working out. Um, you want to talk about comfort, just total comfort. That's what I experience each time I put on a pair of jock straps and some leggings, like right now, literally. So again, it should be a really fun debate. I don't have the time and date yet, but make sure you hit that bell notification. I would love for you to comment, like, and share. You don't have to, but it would be awesome if you did that. And last but not least, that email list, you got to join it. It's free. There's no cost whatsoever. I encourage you and curse and curse. In case something happens, we don't lose contact. That is the main number one reason of joining the live stream. So hope you do that. Wish you a wonderful day. If you're not going to the gym, get your butt over there. If you're fresh from the gym like me, good job. Much love. And um, catch you on the next one. Peace out.